Hello, I'm Dr. Sophie Lund Rasmussen or Dr. Hedgehog. This week is Hedgehog Awareness Week and I will be providing daily tips on how you can make your garden more hedgehog friendly to help save the declining population of hedgehogs in the UK. Sharing habitats with humans in our residential gardens come with a cost. Because every year we see hedgehogs injured in garden incidents. Spring and summer equals garden work. And as the hedgehogs are nocturnal, they're probably resting in their nests while we're doing the garden work. Unfortunately, every year many hedgehogs are injured by garden tools because they're resting in their nests while we're doing the work and they're very exposed to garden tools such as garden strimmers. So when you're doing garden work, please be aware that the hedgehogs are there and they're resting during the day. So before you start strimming, for example, please check the hedges for hedgehogs lying underneath them before you turn your strimmer on. Please make sure to cover wells and holes in your garden because hedgehogs have a relatively poor eyesight. So if they fall down a drain or into a hole and cannot get up again, they'll end up dying from hunger or thirst if not found in time. It's important that you ensure there's an exit route out of your swimming pool or your pond because if the hedgehogs fall into that and can't get up again, they'll end up drowning, even though they're excellent swimmers, but they may drown from exhaustion if they can't get out again. Please make sure not to use poison in your garden because the hedgehogs may become poisoned from eating the poison themselves directly, for example, rodenticides against rats and mice, but also insecticides. If you kill the insects they feed on, or slug pellets for that matter, they may eat, may eat the poison directly, but they can also become poisoned through secondary poisoning when eating the dead slugs or snails or eating the dead mice or rats. Every year, a lot of hedgehogs are hurt by dog bites or dog attacks. So if you have a dog that may be aggressive towards hedgehogs, please make sure it's on a leash when you're walking it at night to ensure that it doesn't attack the hedgehogs. Hedgehogs are not the most agile of creatures and they may get stuck in netting and litter and the netting can cut into the skin and and make horrific infections so please make sure that garden netting is kept safe at night at a height where it doesn't reach the hedgehogs as they're moving around in the garden <laughs>